photo allegedly shows rat droppings on Domino's pizza dough. An anonymous person who claims to work at the Domino's in Johnson City, Tennessee, posted the picture on Reddit. In the post, the individual claims rats are a common sight at the location, and employees don't know how they continue to pass health inspections. Health inspectors say the store has had a rodent problem for at least three years. They previously found 14 trays contaminated with rodent droppings. The store did pass its most recent inspection with a score of 86, and Domino's spokesman, Tim McIntyre, told WJHL this was an extremely isolated incident, confined to a single store, and it's been puzzling. The affected trays were removed. All others were inspected and new ones were delivered. The health department then cleared the store to open. The store is clean, open, and back in business. The person that posted the picture denies that Domino's is trying to clean up the store and says they are willing to lose their job because they feel bad about serving the pizza to people. YouTube, YouTube, what's going on? Trey back again, hit you with a video. Now, this video right here is so disgusting. To Disgusting. I can't even get disgusting out. It's so damn disgusting to me because I know I used to love some pizza and I'm glad that tastes out my mouth. I'm glad the most high God himself came down from heaven and slapped the taste of pizza out my mouth because Lord knows if I would have been in Tennessee at Johnson City at a, this Domino's restaurant with this pizza having rat doo doo in the damn dough in the crust. Oh, I would be so mad. And that should let you know right now that when you see these little strange things in your in your doughs, whether it's your bread, your hamburger buns, your hot dog buns, or your pizza dough. If you see little brat, little brown stuff in there and they look like chocolate s'mores, those are not chocolate and that is not no damn s'more. That is some rat shit. You know what I'm saying? Rather Tuli himself came over here from France and shit it all over Domino's. You feel me? Damn, it was bad enough Little Caesar was beating the hell out of him. And ever since Papa John's made that damn stupid statement, we ain't got to worry about Papa John's. So we like, well, we still got Pizza Hut, even though they mess your stomach up sometimes. And then we said, well, we got Domino's. And come to find out, Domino's is full of shit, literally. So I'm going to read this story, and I'm going to get my opinion. Surely, as we go. Rodent droppings found on Domino's Pizza Dough. A Domino's Pizza restaurant in Johnson City, Tennessee is earning a foul, very foul, reputation after health inspectors discovered rodent droppings on 14 trays, not one tray, not three trays, 14 trays of raw dough in their kitchen. And guess what? You think they threw that damn dough away? Hell no. And I might be talking to a few people right now in Johnson City, Tennessee, that got some of that rat shit up in them. And I'm not trying to be funny. Go to the hospital, man. Go to the hospital. If you don't want to go to the hospital, get you what, what, what the mofos used to give us when we was kids, make us throw up, that uh, cast oil, you know what I'm saying? Something like that. Let me know in the comment section for my people uh, who know about that right there, that stuff that you used to drink when we was young, talking about we didn't want to go to school and then make us throw up and... and automatically we felt better i don't know why i think it's called cast oil but let me know now anyway now after a photo was posted to reddit which appeared to show rat feces yeah that's rat that's rat shit for anybody got rats in their damn house that's rat shit or you got somebody in there with some nappy ass uh beads on their damn uh face that they trying to shave if it if it's not that those are rat pellets now the video showed rat feces thrown across lumps of dough at the Domino's in Boone's Creek. I thought I heard Boone's. I thought about Boone's for him. I don't know why. Now, the state health department intervened on Wednesday. Officials said they were investigating reports of excessive rodent activity. According to the inspection report, in addition to the droppings on the dough, large amounts were also found on the floor, the shelves, in the bathroom, the walk-in coolers and inside empty boxes of chocolate lava cake. God dog, and I love me some chocolate cake. You know, I don't get it from Domino's. But let me repeat this. Because these rats are on what you call on that buck. And for you don't if for those who don't know what on that buck means, because I use all kinds of slang, all kinds of language. My people in the comment section, my uh trusty uh family, please let them know what on that buck mean. Uh these rats was clearly uh fed up they wasn't gonna take it no more they was tired of that shit literally now let me repeat what all they found these little rat pellets on so the next time you go in there you know what to look for matter of fact i wouldn't go in there but i don't want to get sued saying don't go in there you feel me you, you know how it is now it says they found droppings on the dough that's bad enough that's check one large amounts were also found on the floor that's bad that's check two on the shelves oh that's 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 bad too that's three in the bathroom 
That's four. Ooh, that's real bad. How you gonna sit down and use it? How you gonna uh 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 relieve yourself of some shit when you looking down and seeing shit on the damn floor? Ooh, that's too much shit for me. Now, in the walk-in coolers, that's five. In inside empty boxes of chocolate lava cake, that's six. So that's what that means. Guess what that means, my family? Guess what that means, people? If you find this in six different locations, guess what it means? Domino's is full of shit. Let's continue. Now, management of the Domino's restaurant stated that they will remain closed. Need to burn that joker down. That's the only way you'll get rid of them rats. Trust me, anybody ever had a rat infestation problem knows damn well you have to burn the damn house down. You can bum that joker all damn day long. Them rats going to be up in your house with gas masks on, with damn scuba diving gear on. You're going to be in them passed out. Them jokers still going to be eating your food up, shitting all over your floor. Now, Let's repeat this. Management of the Domino's restaurant stated that they will remain closed until the facility is thoroughly clean, until every rat in there that had his asshole cleansed, a colon cleansed, if you will. Now, the contaminated trays in food were immediately thrown out. No shit. Who you going to give them to? I bet they took them damn, damn pizza doughs, made some pizzas, and took that shit right there to their jailhouse somewhere in Tennessee. Call and check on your people uh, in Johnson County, Tennessee. I mean, Johnson City, whatever it is, and check on nigga. They, I don't think they just uh, th threw that damn dough away. They, they gave that dough to somebody. They either took it to one of them crazy hospitals, or they stopped there and threw it in the damn river, or they took it to the jailhouse. And most likely, they probably took it to the jailhouse. So, you know what I'm saying? They can get some more orders. I don't know. Now, the official said he also saw invoices from pest control services pinned to the rodent control glue boards in the restaurant. Management claimed that the exterminator would carry out sweeps at night after the facility was closed. That damn exterminator y'all had another one doing a damn thing. Let me put it in the ways of how it should be said. That exterminator Domino's hired, and I'm going to say this as politically correct as possible. The exterminator Domino hired was not doing shit. Point blank, shit. Now, the inspection report stated the officials inspected a double delivery truck and found no traces of contamination before it dropped off the product at the restaurant. Domino's employees are currently cleaning shelves, floors, etc. During our investigation, the report added, let me, add, let, me, let, me, let me talk to you now. Let me talk to you all. So for those who ever worked in fast food, Burger King, McDonald's, Domino's, Shonis, uh... TGI Fridays, any, any damn well where you're dealing with a mass consumption of food and also people coming there to eat your food, when you're dealing with a large amount of people in public, you have to make sure what? The place is thoroughly clean. And what do you do when you work in these places? You clean them at least once a day or at least twice a week. Everybody does that. The grease, the grease traps that be up at the the food place that you see that be over there that, that hold that grease in, all they have to be clean, not just rat stuff. So that means these people there wasn't cleaning these shelves right or whatnot. Cause there's no way in hell you're supposed to have rat shit just everywhere like that. There's no way in hell somebody wasn't doing their damn job. Didn't it be on the damn bathroom floor? Okay. So who are the people around here that's, that's supposed to be cleaning this bathroom up? Because it seems like to me, as soon as you go in there and clean the bathroom up, unless the rat is spying on you from a distance out of his little hole, you know them little holes they have, unless he's spying on you like, oh yeah, they, oh, 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 Jack just got through cleaning that bathroom. I'm finna go in there and mess that bathroom up right now and doo-doo all over the damn floor. Unless you got rats who's, who's running a regular schedule, a train on that bathroom, uh, just shitting all over the damn floor. No reason why you should have rat shit all over the floor all damn day long in shelves and everywhere else. Let's continue. Now, on Thursday, a Domino spokesperson said the discovery was an extremely isolated incident confined to a single store. And for me to believe that will uh, we'll be to say this right here is that we do not have rats nowhere else in the United States. We only have them in Tennessee in Johnson City inside of this Domino's. How dare you insult our intelligence? We are very more intelligent than that. I bet you it was an isolated incident. You know why? Because somebody there wasn't cleaning that damn store up like it's supposed to be. The exterminator need to be fired and charged for uh, aggravated stupidity. And the workers do also. Because there's no way in hell, except for the worker who put this on blast, we'll give you immunity. You feel me? Because I'm glad that you came out with it. You feel me? Because I know what to look for now. Because the whole time, I done seen little spots and shit in pizza doughs and stuff. I'm like, well, damn, when they, when they started uh, seasoning the dough up, I'm like, damn, don't they just make it a certain way? I'm like, damn, when they started seasoning the dough up, like they finna make fried chicken or something, like they cooking for Popeyes. According to News Channel 11, the facilities issues with animals 
rodents and inspects dates back to 2015. Damn, them, them rats been whooping their ass a long time. I would have been shut that store down. However, it is unclear whether the problems back then were related to the droppings found in the restaurant this week. Boy, it's a daddy rat round there. It's a granddaddy rat round there. And it's a daddy, uh, I mean, it's a mama rat and a grandma rat running around there making all them babies. You feel me? Making all them babies. You got to, in, 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 in order to, uh, to, get, to get the snake, to kill the snake, you got to chop off the head. You got to go to the source of the problem. It's the reason. Why y'all is not getting rid of these rats? Y'all ain't found the uh, the breeders of the bunch. You feel me? Y'all ain't found the kingpins. Because there's somebody around there calling them shots at Domino's. Anyway, now, person said, we ate that pizza like a week ago. And I feel sorry for you, not for your mother, for your stomach. I feel sorry for your stomach talking about we ate that pizza like a week ago. That's surprising to understand that they could find that and sell us that pizza. Jess Bowman, a local customer told WJHL and Jess Bowman, if you ever come across, if you ever, 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 ever come across this video, please, pretty please, go get your stomach pumped or go get it checked because let me tell you something, rats are some nasty things, you know what I'm saying, I, I just can't stand them, you know, I just can't stand them. Anyway, you need to go get checked. Now, Domino's did not respond to a request for coming, I bet you the hell they didn't. Let me know what you all think, and to my people in Johnson City, Tennessee, please, Please be careful uh, eating at these Domino's and also all over this damn country and matter of fact, the whole world. But right now, the spotlight is on Domino's. Now, let me know what you all think about this video. It's sad that you would have rats. You know what I'm saying? Don't even take the time out to go outside to use the bathroom. Would take a shit right over pizza though, knowing that Domino's barely making some damn money anyway. You messing up damn 14 trays of damn dough. And they'll tell you how many you messed up in the past. So in all, if they say 14, it might have been 14,000 or 1,400. It's something. Anyway, let me know what you all think about this video. If you like the video, push that like button. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel. Definitely share the video with your people who love pizza. I don't like pizza that much like I used to. You know what I'm saying? I'm good with all that. Too much damn dough stop you up, make you big and shit. That shit was cool when I was a kid. Anyway, let me know what you all think about this mess. And like I said, if you ate some of this damn pizza, oh, you need to go get checked because you might be going to the upper room. I'm out.